move for you here, we have a straddle kettlebell shoulder press. All right, so this is actually a more intense variation of our seated shoulder press. So first option would be to do a seated shoulder press. So you're either gonna use a bench, a chair, or something to sit on, grab those two kettlebells, nice, strong, straight spine, and you'll either alternate that shoulder press or you'll give me that double shoulder press. All right, from there we remove the bench and we'll take a seat on the floor. And you can start with those legs kind of in a little bit narrow, position. All right, but you want to hinge with those hips, keep a nice tall straight spine, and then again we'll either alternate the shoulder press or we'll do a double shoulder press. <sighs> to advance this move again, now that we're seated on the ground, we can go ahead and take a little bit wider of a straddle. So we'll get that nice strong straddle position, nice tall spine, abs in, grab those two kettlebells, and you'll either alternate that shoulder press or again, that double shoulder press. That is your straddled kettlebell shoulder press.